grief, sadness, the inability to express grief or sadness, or even simply the inability to express at all. Uh, not being able to speak up, not being able to say what's really in your heart. Grief belongs to the metal element in Chinese medicine. It also belongs to the fifth chakra, the throat chakra. Uh, the points are conception vessel 22. So you have your collarbones right here and the little knobby ends and there's just a little bit of a space between them and that's where the point is right there don't stick in too far it's not comfortable but you sink into that point that's conception vessel 22 uh, a power point for the throat chakra and for helping to build resiliency in the face of grief so we want to give voice to our sorrows. We want to honor that which has passed away. Think about a moving and inspiring eulogy. So that she, with grief, can kind of disappear. You may feel a nothingness. Um, that's just a temporary state in response to this emotion. Using these points can, um, as I say, build your resiliency to um, experiencing these emotions. We don't want to have no emotions. Uh, life is full of emotion. Uh, it's by knowing one thing that we understand its opposite. We know when it's cold because we've experienced hot. Anyway, so we have CV-22. And then we have the two points on the hand. We have large intestine 4, which is between, oh, let's get lined up here, between the forefinger and the thumb, in between the long bones. So this is very similar to uh, how liver three is found on your foot. This is large intestine four. We also have lung nine. Let's go with this hand. And it's at the base of the thumb, right at the wrist, and you want to be just on the palm side of this tendon right here at the edge. And you'll find a little place to sink into. That's lung 9, large intestine 4, CV 22. Give voice to your sorrows.